My fellow citizens, it's too late for Saddam Hussein to remain in power. For their own safety, all foreign nationals should leave Iraq immediately. Al Jazeera has been inviting the U.S. government officials to speak directly on their channel. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. We have their points of view balanced by our own. We're dealing with people that are perfectly willing to lie to the world to attempt to further their case. Jira, they've got the best food. They're also the nicest guys. You're welcome to have dinner or whatever. Oh, I would love to. What Al Jazeera is struggling with is when there isn't a sort of a long tradition of being independent in any one of these kingdoms, how do you establish that now? Journalists tend to stick together, just like soldiers stick together. Can't give you any better answer than that. Good try, though. <laughs> Incredible. If I'm offered a job with Fox, I will take it. You lose the war. These are the Shia who are receiving the Americans with flowers. You've got Al Jazeera pounding the people in the region with things that are not true. It's just like Fox plays to American patriotism. It benefits Al Jazeera to play their nationalism. Misunderstanding is running across the board. It's so complex. Your journalists have a position on the war. Are any U.S. journalists objective about this war? This is a war and people are dying. We got the pictures and we show them. The decision by Al Jazeera to broadcast such material is deplorable. It was a show. It was a media show. Wasn't that Thank powerful? You. We just Thank think you. all the folks that died to make those moments happen. You are the most powerful nation on earth. I agree. You can defeat everybody. I agree. But don't ask us to love it as well. <laughs>